I'm in a situation where uh, my father is very successful. I have not accomplished shit yet. Right. You are, um, how can I say this? You're an incredibly wise human being. You've put out a multitude of content. I don't know how much wisdom can be packed into one human being, but I mean, you exist. And so because of that, you inspire me, and I, I'm, I'm, I'm at this age where I'm 23, entering the best years of my life, correct? Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm about to, so. hey, I'm very confused. I give up everything to be 23. Would you all, of, all of it. To redo it? Every, 100%. Absolutely. Time is the number one thing. Like more time, like 18 more years? 100%, all of it. Really? Yeah, 100%. <laughs> Like that's like, like you guys should be real happy. I look at these young faces, I'm like, fuck. Yeah. So go ahead. Oh, I, like I was saying, you know, there's just a lot of pressure to be great like him. Yeah. Um, and I was just wondering, like, corporate finance. Yes, I'm in it right now. I'm on the right path. Maybe. Does, I'll, does he want you to be a CFO? That's exactly what he wants me to be. Do you want to be a CFO? Slightly. I want to be successful. I want right. to make him proud. He's done a lot for me. I can repay him by being successful. I also want to be an actor. Have you ever told him any of your truths? Or do you appease what he wants for now? A little bit of both. A yeah. little bit of both. Look, I think, look, your, dad's lo- your dad loves you way more than he wants you to appease him. No matter what you believe. And I think, I think the sooner you can have an honest conversation, like a real honest one, the sooner you can start doing, you may have a conversation with your dad this summer where you get really real off the momentum of this, mm-hmm. and you may realize when you're done with it that fuck, you actually want to be a CFO. It, the, the key is to just have the conversation. Yeah. I mean, until then, I'll keep busting my ass. Hey, yeah, but, but, but that's like, like you, busting your ass is fine and dandy. Ha, if you actually, like if this is the thing that you wanted to bring up, I'm telling you, yeah. as scary as it may be, the real truth conversation, is your mom around and involved? Of course. Does she know how you feel? Does she play the good cop kind of thing? Like, or is, like, or is she kind of like reinforced? Like what? They both want me to hit a target that's hittable. That's what they keep saying. Hit the target that's hittable. Right. Because the acting target, the Broadway, the and the Hollywood, there's a small targets to hit. Let me give you. Let me give you a really, really, really good wisdom-based thing. Please do. You love your parents? Absolutely. I figured based on your vibe. If you don't do what you want to do you're gonna end up regretting it, which is then gonna manifest at being mad at them, and you are doing a greater disservice to the relationship of you and your parents by not doing what you wanna do than by doing what they want you to do. There's a seed of what you actually wanna do. You're hiding that seed because you love your parents so much, right? Yes, sir. You're gonna then do that, and then you're gonna be 42 and not have the chance to do your thing, and you're gonna be mad at them and you're gonna blame them for it, and then it's gonna hurt your relationship, not help it. That's it. That's That's real. It's really real, and it's like, it's the biggest advice I give to kids. I love my parents too, like, like, fucking, I love, I love, like, I think you're coming from a great place. You just don't realize yet what the cost of suppressing your own wants and desires, how it manifests. And that's how it's gonna manifest. So you gotta give that thought. Yes, sir. Cool. Yes, sir. Thank My you pleasure. Hey, can I get a picture with you? I yeah. got ten percent left. I mean, Let's I didn't go. have time to charge. I didn't know I you were still be here. Honestly, <laughs> <laughs> I, thought, I thought you were gonna be gone in your hotel. Can someone, all right, someone, take a picture? Of I live in New York City. Do you really? Yeah. So do I for the next two months. <laughs> um, this is a flash. You got me, man. I'm gonna act super surprised. I'm gonna be like, whoa. Thank you, man. Thank you. No, no, I'm not gonna hold it all. Thank you, though. Yeah. Hey man, keep working hard, keep grinding. Keep doing your thing. You're already at the top, you're gonna be more at the top. Thank you, man.